morning everyone. It's a lovely morning, we're heading out for a bit of a early morning surf cast off the rocks today. Should have been earlier but I was still in bed, it's a bit cold. So stick around and we'll hope to get some fish. Not be like yesterday, we already got nothing. So I had to delete that footage. Yay, there's nobody on the rock. I'm just gonna cast over here and yeah, maybe this side. I've got one rod, but I'll change alternate between this side of the rock and that side of the rock. So we are actually in quite a busy fishing area, um, boat wise. So you've got to be quite careful. Thank you, Evan. Right, I'm going to chuck around over here somewhere, I think. I'm a bit wary of taking this camera here, so I'll probably stick to the GoPro. A lot of the shots around here because of the rocky, the rocky terrain we're on. But look at that. See, what a beautiful day here. Awesome day. So there we go, it's a nice Trevally. I haven't caught a Trevally in, in ages. Awesome, good eating fish. So there we go guys, look at that. Only been here about 10 minutes. That's a nice fish. Good little fighters too. Trevally, yep, great fish. All right, we're gonna bait up. Sorry about the camera angles, it's just really hard to, uh, I don't want to film with my, this camera here, so I've got to try and cut in between. So that was the last bait I chucked out. As you can see there, there's just bones left, so we've got little pickers out there. You gotta bleed your kahawai. The best way to do it, I find, if, if you bang it on the head, this is the, probably the most humane way. Bang it on the head, because you have to bleed them, 
is to cut through up here and you see and then it's you break its neck and then it's usual cover wire bleeding now you really got to bleed your kahawai, some guys don't, but that is the best way, and then you don't taint your fish either. I see blood coming out of there. So today I'm gonna, I've got my charcoals, I'm going to put a little fire down here on the beach and I'm going to fry up a nice piece of kahawai and some butter, salt and pepper, some, some tartia sauce we're going to have a beautiful fish burger just got to catch another fish would be nice or two so stick around it's a lovely day and I wish you guys could be here with me Especially you, Muzz and Reese and Shane. We are you guys. I forgot to text you this morning. Sorry about that. I was heated up. And we'll put the pan on. Ouch. And we'll cook our fish up. Right now we're going to fillet the fish and we'll get it ready for our fish burger. Fish burger for breakfast. It's just gone past 10 o'clock. Fishing went dead, so I thought I had enough of that. I'm hungry. Come cook up a fish burger. I'll find myself a little table. So I'll burn, we'll cut that open. We'll get that ready. We've got our lemon, cut that as well. Our butter for our pan, our tomato for our burger, and our tartia sauce. Cut that, and our lettuce for it as well. But what I've forgotten, I've forgotten my blimmin' salt and pepper. I was in too much of a hurry this morning. I forgot most, one of the most important ingredients besides butter that is the salt and pepper Oh uh, well, I'll we'll just put a bit more extra butter on there and a bit more extra tartia sauce Right, I think I can't wait any longer I'm going to put the charcoals in the ground here Looks good enough for me Put our pan on there. Oh yeah. Add some butter. Just a little bit of butter on there. That'll be enough. Might add some more a bit later on. To make up for the salt. Oh yeah. Oh, that smells nice. Uh, Pick the towels. Ooh. I cut my fish up so that'll fit into the pan. 
Yeah. Look at that. Nice. It won't take too long to cook that up. The best way to cook fish, I think, is in butter. Nice. Put a stir in there. buttery kahawai fillet or fillet right we're going to do our buns now just put that on there and then we'll toast our bun straight onto the coals that shouldn't take too long yep not too bad at all who's hungry fish on there mm, nice I'll just put those tomatoes in the pan soak the butter up we add all the other ingredients as well Put our bun over here. All right, we'll add our tartar sauce, or what do you call it? Tartar sauce. Some lemon juice on there. We'll add our tomatoes on top of that. We have any room to put two slices on there and some lettuce on top of that. And there we have a nice fresh fish burger, easily cooked. And I think we'll just add a bit of that buttery sauce on there as well. Just a bit of that on. There it is, tasty fish burger. I think all there is to do now is eat it. What do you guys think? Right, so mm. there is a tasty filet of fish. Just zoom in on that a bit. Mm. Fresh out of the water, nice. Mm. Mm, that is nice. There you go. Lovely cooked. Shame about the <laughs> So there we have it. Mmm. Beautiful burger. Doesn't get much better than that. Right? Come up here. Come over here. Mmm. Beautiful. Mm.
doesn't get much fresher than that, does it? Been hanging out for a real fresh burger for ages. Very, very nice. Must be them buy one from the shop. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed this little video. Mix up for yesterday when we went fishing and got nothing. And that. That's what it's all about. Absolutely delicious. So thanks for watching guys. Thanks for the comments. Well, good comments anyway. And I hope this helps you all get out there and, and gather a gather a feed. And enjoy it. So for my sunny place here in New Zealand, Fakatani, I'll we'll catch all you guys later. We'll see you all on the next video. Mmm. Delicious. I rubber. <laughs>